Hello everyone, welcome back to the shed. I'm Lonnie and uh, I haven't done the work I planned on doing today. Candace was off, so we've been uh, a little bit leisurely, but I did pack up my makeup orders. I got those out of the way. And then we went to, we went to this place that does um, camper tops. And I ordered a camper top for my truck. It's like this. It's going to be like this. Um, going to be the same color as the truck and stuff. So pretty excited about that. That's about 10 weeks out. It's going to be way better, I think, than the... Um, I have like a bed cover now that you have to fold up. So anyways, that's what I've been doing so far today. Let me grab some lunch. And now I'm going to pull a few orders. Um, let's see, I sold... I just listed this the other day and sold it pretty quickly. It's the Sony... PlayStation 1 right here. Make sure I get all the cables and whatnot. Power cable, video cable, controller, and the console itself. This stuff sold, oh, and a memory card. This sold for $34.99 plus shipping on top. Kimberly ordered some blackened black eyeliner, MU20. Should be right over here. Blackened black eyeliner. Let's see. Here we go. There's your blackened black eyeliner. $9 free ship. Thank you very much, Kimberly. Appreciate the business. Next, I sold a watch. This is one of the ones, uh, if you watch the channel, I just got this going the other day. I pressed the back on it. It is this fossil watch here uh, with a carpenter, carpenter scene there. Uh, and yeah, if I push the, whatever you call that little thing right there, if I push that in, it will tick because it's got a new battery in it. Uh, it's going out to Martin in the UK. It's a gift for his father for Christmas. Thank you very much, Martin. Appreciate it. And I hope your dad likes the watch. Sold a Nintendo case that I just listed yesterday. This guy right here. Sold this for $24.99 plus shipping on top. And um, I think I recognize the name, but I'm not 100%. But it's going out to Rocco. So Rocco, thank you very much if you're a viewer. Um, yeah, that was fast. Okay, I have a Mizuno GOC7 glove. And I've had this for quite a while too. I think it might be this one. Professional model. Max Flex. World Wind GOC7. Here we go. I've had this for quite a while and um, I had it priced. Look, look at the condition of this glove. It is in fantastic condition. You don't see them in that kind of condition too often. Um, anyway, I had this priced at a hundred bucks for quite a while and somebody messaged me on eBay and said, Hey, will you take 70? And I'm like, yeah, well, I mean, I don't remember what I paid for this, probably five bucks or less. But uh, yeah, $70 plus shipping on top. That's pretty good. Just pulling this, uh, who's this? Sculpting gloss, blah, blah, blah. Uh, sold it for $21.99. But the interesting part is, please do not include invoice or eBay packaging. Remove the price tag from the box. If it has, thank you very kindly. Okay, well, that's not, uh, I got drop shipped, obviously. They sold the, they sold this via some other market or might have even been on eBay. And uh, yeah, they they made more, some money off of me, which is fine. Uh, and they made a few demands, which I would probably follow up on anyways. Uh, I guess I won't throw a garage flip sticker in this box, although I might, maybe I will. But drop shippers don't bother me at all. One last thing is for Michael, uh, Michael bought TNA History of TNA Year One and Kurt Angle Champion two disc set. A couple of wrestling. Are these both sealed? 
Yes, they're both sealed. Uh, he said he saw them sitting on the shelf in a video. So he picked them up. Where did he see those? He must have saw them over here. They're the last two I have left. Perfect. Yep, Kurt Angle two disc set and history of TNA. Awesome. So thank you very much, Michael. Hope you enjoy. And this is where all the Beanie Babies have been sitting in here. I already took, took two Ikea bags full already. I'm bringing these two now. Have some other odds and ends here too. Uh, basically, this is overflow. Whenever I bought all those Beanie Babies, I had to put them somewhere. I didn't know where to put them, so I got this. Hopefully, just for this month. Hopefully, like, end of November, I should be out of here. These things are a little bigger than I expected. Um, I just put this. I could fit a few more in here. I probably will, too. I'll probably put as many as I can. Uh, but I've got 50 in there so far. 52. 54. 56. 57. Let me grab some more at the truck. 58, 59, 60. Now, how do I feel about this? I feel like I can go more. I'm going to put 10 more. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Nine, ten. Okay, I would call that a good box. So, throw these over here. And I'm going to spread out Beanie Babies on the bench and start taking photographs. This is my first load here. Would you believe this is only 70 Beanie Babies? I'm questioning how many I actually have now. I... My guy estimated it was like 2,500. There's no way I have 2,500 if this is 70. So we'll see how many I end up having. Uh, I did make a decision just now. I am going to run this at auction. I'm going to see what happens. I'm not necessarily going to run all of them at auction, but this first load, I think I'm going to do that with. 70 Beanie Babies weighs 21 pounds. 21.62 pounds. So 22 pounds. Okay, listed my first lot now. Pretty pretty short description. Lot of 70 standard size Thai Beanie Babies, all with hang tags. Seven day auction, starting at a penny. And here we go. All right. And uh, yeah, y'all aren't going to see too much of any baby for too long because I'm going to do them all in big lots like that. But I finally got the first one listed. About time, huh? Thank y'all very much for watching. I'll see y'all again soon. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.